hello from future Kendra. You're about to watch our family trip to Broken Bow, Oklahoma. Everything is edited, I'm about to play the footage, but I started to think, huh, not everybody knows we went to this little trip, and if I just put this video up here, it might not make sense to people. So I thought I'd do a little intro, let you know what you're about to watch, and then I'm gonna check back in at the end and kind of like talk about the trip just a little bit more. So um, we did just get back from a trip to Broken Bow, Oklahoma. We went for four days, it's a really quick trip, and we rented a cabin, it was wonderful, and I have a little like vacation montage of cute moments to share with you so let's go ahead and watch that show you how, how it's really done? Okay, here you go.
Don't put it in his mouth. Of course, Oh my God. Are you all right? Oh my God. Are you okay? I need to wash it out. Oh. Y'all, it was such a great trip. I'm very proud of myself, first of all, for getting this video up within like days of us being home. For those who have been following along for a while, you know, I'm like notorious for taking vlogs when we trip, when we go on vacations, I mean, and I'm never editing them. I'm so bad about that and I have to get better about it because as a family, we love looking back on these videos. It's so neat to see the boys like grow through these little vacations that we take, um, especially our yearly trip to Colorado. So I'm like, I don't know, three years behind on editing these. So the fact that I'm getting this one up within like a couple days is amazing I'm proud of myself obviously anyway the trip was great we had so much fun we literally did nothing nothing we stayed at the cabin the whole entire time we left one time to go to a local grocery store and that was like a quick trip but other than that we stayed at the cabin and I'm so proud of us because not only did we stay at the cabin but we really took massive advantage of what the cabin had to offer we hot tubbed it up sometimes a couple times a day we used the fire pit daily almost all day 
Um, you can see the dogs running in the woods behind the cabin. We explored back there. We went hunting for mushrooms. We went looking for bugs. The dogs played in the creek behind the cabin. Um, the cabin inside, you could see there's like the part where I'm sitting in the chair and the boys are cuddling on me. Um, they were actually watching a TV show. We do not have cable in our house at home, like our, this house here. We um, have Hulu and Netflix, and so they don't really get to watch a lot of the shows that kids typically know about, like... What was the one that they really loved? Vampirina. And I liked Fancy Nancy. And we let them watch TV without, like, there was no guilt it, as a parent to let them just sit in front of the TV and veg out because that's really not normal for us. And they really enjoyed that. Um, there's one bedroom in this cabin, and it has a king-size bed. And we all slept in the king-size bed. And I can tell you, okay, the nights, honestly, were not the best. Weston kicked me all night long. Carson, who is usually the really bad sleeper, did decently well. But I swear I probably have bruises on my back from Weston kicking me all night. But it was so wonderful to wake up um, in the morning and just wake up next to my boys. And Carson would wake up in the morning and the first thing he would say is, Mama, I love you. I mean, that was just precious. So it was just a really great trip. Our last few trips that we've taken, and they're all kind of the same thing. We really like to road trip and stay in cabins. So the last few, we tend to take family with us, and we've been to these places several times before. So when we take family, it's more about um, loving on them and taking them out for a good time and showing them all of our favorite places, which we absolutely love as well. But it, it can get a little bit busy somewhat. So it's nice just to like stay home and do nothing and just veg I say stay home it was in our house obviously but to stay in the cabin and do nothing and just veg and just enjoy the property um we will definitely be going back to this cabin as many cabins as we've stayed in and as many beautiful places we visited for some reason this one in particular just it touched all of our hearts we all just loved it I think Carson probably said mama I love this cabin at least a hundred times he was seeing it all day long uh, because it was really just that wonderful for us so um, for those who want more information on the cabin that we stayed in I will leave info down in the description box of the the cabin that the actual like name of the cabin that we rented the location it's in and where you can also reach out and rent it if you would like to stay in as well if you do visit it and you get to go let me know I would love to know if one of our videos inspired you to go rent a certain cabin um, that would make my cabin lover heart very happy but I will see you in the next one all right thanks so much for going on a trip with us bye